She began her athletics career out of admiration for her brother Bernard Lagat, who set the pace for a family of world-beating athletes. Viola Lagat has since risen to the top and is among Kenya's representatives in the women's 1500 meters at the 2016 Olympic Games. Bernard switched allegiance to the United States, but his impact on Viola's athletics career and rise to the top is something she holds dear. In 2014, my, I wasn't running that fast and I wasn't happy with my training. So when I moved to train with my brother last year, we started on a lower level knowing that um, I would need a lot of time to get to where I am now. And since then, I started training with him. I came to Kenya and did the trials for the World Championships and I made the team. And so that was quite an improvement compared to when I wasn't training with him. Viola, Judith Yen. Viola finished third at the national trials held at the Kipchoge Keino Stadium in Eldoret last month and she attributes her fitness to well-equipped training facilities in Arizona, United States, where she lives and studies on a sports scholarship. We have a lot of, um, a lot of things when it comes to training. The tr we have available tracks. We don't have to pay to get into a track to do my, tra my training sessions. And then we also have the gym. They're also free because my coach is coaching at the college, so we, I would go there. And then we have a lot of physiotherapists. As she prepares to represent her country on a big stage for the second time, after the 2015 World Championship, she says teamwork alongside Faith Chepngatich and Nancy Chepkwemoy will be key to a satisfactory result at the August Games. Just making the right steps to make it to the final, and that's starting with the preliminaries and making it to the same as and eventually to the finals. and hoping to get in the podium, so it's going to take a, a lot of work, but I'm willing to do the job. Viola will be hoping a steady rise to the top, coupled with the intensive training at the team camp in Eldoret, will propel her to her biggest achievement yet, an Olympic medal.